All right, so uh, I'm seeing Captain Marvel today, but before I do make the review with this uh, GoPro, that's the camera I use, I'm gonna just show off my DVD collection. All right, I guess we'll start with, uh, all right, so there's the TV I usually watch it on. There's my Nintendo Switch, Spider-Man poster. Let's uh, take a look, all right. Yeah, I work at Roche Brothers. Well, uh, movies I got, there's three ninjas. The fourth one, six movie collection, Nickelodeon movies. I've seen one of those. <laughs> Bugs Life, Christmas Carol. Christmas Story, Adventures, and Babysitting, Adventure... Th three stuff with Adventure and Adventure Time. Last Airbender Complete Series. Great show. Six, Charlie. This is horrible. An okay movie. I'd rather talk about a movie I haven't seen in a while. Narnia, Clockstoppers, the Dragons, Dinosaur, um, I guess I'll just scroll by. Anything I have something to say about, I guess I'll talk about because it'll be repetitive if I just name them all. Alright, so, uh, now on to horror. You got a little uh, Jurassic World, a Dairy Queen cup. And, uh, Chucky, the Mummy. It was a really just awful movie. Alright. Alright, so. DVDs, got a Critters, it's really, from what I've heard, it's really weird, it looks kind of interesting, 28 Days movies, it's always oh, Chucky, this one is really weird, you see, it's a 3D package, I don't know if you can tell it from here, his eyes kind of follow you it includes all of them up to the second one I'm, I'm looking forward to the remake maybe it'll be good it, they, they removed the voodoo aspect that's a little strange but that's kind of interesting you got uh gremlins my favorite christmas movie uh, final destination from dusk till dawn so far the favorite movie i saw for the first time this year happy death day pretty good i uh, didn't enjoy the sequel i am legend it's now the the it movies I have now the remake I like better than the original but the original I like the first half and the remake is basically the first half so you know, Jaws one of my favorite horror movies ever Jurassic Park and the Jurassic Park movies Fallen Kingdom I didn't think was awful Jurassic World I did like, though the characters aren't that good. Chris Pratt wasn't that enjoyable. How do you do that? It takes talent to do that. Right, uh, oh, Little Shop of Horrors. This is like my favorite dark musicals ever. Yeah, Singing Plant, A Daring Hero, A Sweet Girl, and A Demented Dentist. <laughs> it's amazing. Lost World Jurassic Park, Manhunter. Yeah, a lot of people don't know. Silence of the Lambs is actually uh, a sequel to uh, a movie called Manhunter. I will! So then we have a, a in my Shyamalan collection, Signs, The Sixth Sense, and Unbreakable. I like all those movies. Like I, I understand why some people don't like Signs, but I enjoy Signs. Monster Squad, Night Gal, Monster Squad, Monster Squad's pretty good. Night Gallery, haven't seen. 
The Living Dead, Paranormal Activity, Phantom of the Opera. That man has a really bad singing voice. The Predator Trilogy. I like the first Predator a lot. And I like... It was fine. <laughs> and uh, Predators, I really, I also liked. Predator is one of the my favorite horror movies. Psycho. That was pretty good. I didn't think it was amazing, but... Rear Window, I loved. So, the whole movie's his perspective. That's the Living Dead movies. Now, Return of the Living Dead is my favorite zombie movie. I won't spoil it, but it's pretty good. The se the wolves are... Most of the se The sequels are mostly hit or miss. Like, this sequel I thought was good, but not as good. And this sequel, same... This <sighs> Necropolis and Rape to the Grave were just awful. They were really bad. Uh, all right, so now uh, Scream, the Scream movies. Scream's one, two, and three. I like the first one, the second one, third one, not so much. Fourth one, I did enjoy. Some people didn't like it, but I like Scream 4. Snakes on a plane I have not seen. So I don't know much about Split. I saw this year I really liked. Storm of the Century I haven't seen. Sweeney Todd I did enjoy. Johnny Depp's pretty good in it. Tremors. It's one of my favorite horror movies. I mean, the sequels are, again, mostly hit or miss. Like, the second one's pretty good. The third one is kind of feels like a sci-fi TV movie, but... It has some good moments. The fourth one, it's okay. The, the newer ones are just, I completely forgot about. All right, so now the, uh, the action. It's a mess. There's Cheetos and, like, Mission Impossible Fallout. All right, so now we got the Lethal Weapon movies. Now... I like I like the first one. I thought the sequel was okay. These two. Do not like. You know you want to know why? It's because of that that little pep squeak right there. Joe Pesci as uh, Leo Getz. I, I, I don't like him. I, I think he's annoying. 20,000 Leagues, Animatrix. Animatrix, it feels like a dream, but I'm kind of intrigued by it. Armageddon, The A-Team, Back to Future. This is one of my favorite movies, trilogies ever. I think it's my favorite trilogy, actually. The, the Back to the Future trilogy. Because uh, all the characters I remember, even the ones minute as... Uh, even the ones as minute as... Uh, Goldie Wilson. I remember him. He's the mayor. Yeah, so best science, really great science fiction movie. I, I definitely recommend it. The third one, it's not as good, but it's still pretty good. The first two are the best ones. The first one is just perfect. All right, so Battle of Los Angeles, Bill and Ted. I like, I like, I like Bogus Journey a lot better with... Walter Bernaziak said about how it feels like a canceled sequel that actually happened. I feel that. The Blade Runner movies, they're they're pretty good. Good. Uh, the Bourne movies, haven't seen Bourne Ultimatum. Bullet, that was pretty good. Charlie's Angels. It's so weird, but I kind of enjoy it. Haven't seen Full Throttle. Cliffhanger, haven't seen Close Encounters of the Third Kind. I have seen it. It's pretty good. Recommend it. <laughs> Death Proof. 
Uh, the Die Hard movies. Die Hard, one of my favorite Christmas movies and action movies. Really like Die Hard. Uh, I like Die Hard 3 out of the sequels. My favorite Die Hard sequel is Die Hard 3. Die Hard 2 I thought was pretty good. I haven't seen Liffy or A Good Day to Die Hard. Doom. Now, from what I've heard of the game, you uh, shoot space demons. The movie, it's just zombies. So creative. Uh, the Expendables movies, I, I've seen the first two. I haven't seen the third one. I heard the third one was garbage. Uh, Jackie Chan's First Strike, I don't even know what that is. I just found it at the thrift store. The Fugitive, it's a, a really fun action movie with Harrison Ford. Pretty good. Really great. Uh, Gattaca, I... Gladiator, The Goonies. Goonies is also really good. Uh, Great Escape, Hollywood Land, Inception, Independence Day, the Indiana Jones movies. These are really good. I love the Indiana Jones movies. I don't hate the fourth one. I'm just going to be honest. I like the fourth one. It's a rare thing here, but I, I did like the fourth one. And we got uh, those. I don't know what those are. Uh, I mean, I do iRobot, the interpreter, but I haven't seen them. Uh, James Bond collection. I've only seen Dr. No. It was pretty good. Uh, uh, Jumanji, Welcome to the Jungle. I loved the first Jumanji. And I like this one, too. I'm looking forward to the upcoming sequel that's coming out in December. Oh, oh no, I just dropped that. Let me just pick that up. It's okay. Right now, moving on, we have uh, oh, these are these are the keys from Ready Player One. Got that at uh, Newberry Comics. Now. Next, here we have uh, the John Wick movies. I've only seen the first one, but the first one is really great. Probably one of the best modern action movies, and uh, Keanu Reeves is great in it. Kill Bill, I haven't seen The Last Samurai. All I've heard is that Tom Cruise plays it, a Japanese person. It sounds strange, American playing a not American, but it's happened before and it felt natural, so who knows. Uh, the Tomb Raider movies. I saw the first one. I, I thought it was fine. Hang on a minute. It's reconnecting. All right, we're back. Okay, uh, where were we? Uh, oh, ow, ow. Uh, Lord of the Rings. Really good sword and sorcery movies. You get the Mad Max. I've seen the first two. They're pretty good. The Matrix, I do like. I don't think it's amazing. Those impossible movies are great, except for the second one. The Mummy movies, I like the first one. The next two aren't good. Perfect Storm, I do remember liking, but I haven't seen it in a while. Pirates of the Caribbean movies, I like Caribbean movies. I like the first one. The second one and the third are fine, I guess. Ready Player One, I enjoyed. It was pretty good. Uh, Star Wars movies. These are pretty good. Last Jedi is a very controversial movie. Though, uh, the, uh, Phantom prequels aren't, aren't great. Aren't really that good, but Revenge of the Sith is pretty good. It's now, uh, all right, now, this is one of my favorites, uh, the Stranger Things DVDs. Now, let's just take out one. At, oh. So, this is a Stranger Things. Now, when you take it out, it looks like a VHS. It's really hard. It's actually really light. If you like, hang on a minute. Now, then you open it. Oh, yeah, this is like a free poster friends don't lie uh and there's the blu-rays for stranger things it's on netflix but i kind of wanted to shelve it and it looks cool oh hang on a minute now 
All right, next I'm gonna show off the uh, season two DVD for Stranger Things. I'm looking forward to season three. It looks, it sounds promising. I think it's gonna be the last one, but I'm not sure. Season two, uh, Friends Rewind, tampering with the cassette. There's, it is again. Oh yeah, it says, uh, charge 50 cents if the tape is from Rewind. I don't really know if that's true or not. Oh, and there's some set photos. It's neat. Can you open it? What's that? And open that. There's Hopper in the Upside Down. But not in the Upside Down, but he's in uh, that tunnel thing, which might be a gateway to the Upside Down, but I'm not sure. Right, so... Now, uh, the Super Mario Brothers movie, it's really strange. It barely has anything to do with the game, and it's kind of convoluted. The Terminator films, I've only seen the first two, but new one's coming out, so I'm going to get around to it. Top Gun, pretty good. Total Recall, really awesome action movie. Uh, Transformers... Did not enjoy the first one. I, I thought Bumblebee was okay, but... Well, Van Helsing I haven't seen. Now on to uh, comedy. Oh. So, move that. Move that a little to the side. All right, now... Comedy, all right. So, uh... Leslie Nielsen collection, which includes, uh... The Naked Gun, Naked Gun two and a half, Naked Gun thirty three and a third, and uh, wrongfully accused. The Jump Street movies they are one of my so my two of my favorite county movies ever. Really funny. Haven't seen Forty Old Virgin, Fifty First Dates, Abbott and Costello. Those are really good. Happy Gilmore, I like. Billy Madison, haven't seen. Airplane was pretty good. Uh, what else in here that I've seen? Beetlejuice, that's really good. The Big Lebowski is also really good. Oh, gosh. And the Blues Brothers, that's really good comedy uh, musical. Haven't seen Bride Wars. Bruce Almighty, I thought was pretty... I thought it was fine, I guess. She, by the desert. City Slickers, I don't remember much of. And then we get all these that I haven't... Okay, Ghostbusters. It's my... Favorite. But... The sequel... I still like, but it's not great. I'm looking forward to the new one that's coming out. It looks pretty good. And it's a sequel to the original, unlike this, which is... Really forgettable. Ferris Bueller, I, I really liked it. Freddy got fingered. It's really weird, but I kind of respect it because it's clearly intentionally bad. You can tell by a red carpet interview. Uh, Groundhog Day, one of the one of my favorite comedies ever. It's pretty good. The Hangover, another one of my favorite comedies ever. The, hang the sequels. The Hangover 3 was okay. This... Uh, it's not good. Uh, Hot Fuzz, uh, another one of my favorite comedies. I uh, haven't seen those. Johnny Dangerously, I liked. Seen that, haven't seen that, haven't seen that. I like this, it's pretty good. Well, it's not like the most original film ever. Right, Mars Attacks. The Mel Brooks films. Now, I've seen all of these in here. My favorite ones out of all of them are probably Blazing Saddles. History of the World Part 1, Robin Hood Men in Tights, The Twelve Chairs, and To Be or Not to Be. The other ones I thought were pretty good, but not the best. And Blazing Saddles, and and Blazing Saddles is probably my favorite out of all of them. <laughs> I mean, the only one rated G, or I think it's rated G. Hang on a minute. 
Let me check on the bottom of this. It's, uh... Yeah, the only rated G is 12 chairs, and it's surprisingly good. But it's, like, one of Mel Brooks's early films. It's interesting. You should check it out. Christmas Vacation. Pretty good Christmas movie. Overboard. Haven't seen. Pink Panthers. I've seen the first one. It's pretty good. Planes, Trains, and Automobiles. My favorite Thanksgiving movie. and Probably the only Thanksgiving movie, though. But... Producers I haven't seen yet. I'm looking into it, but it's a musical. So, Risky Business I liked. Rush Hour, one of my favorite cop movies. It's really good. Raising Arizona was pretty good. Same with Risky Business. Rush Hour Two I thought was also pretty good, but not as good. Scary movie I thought was average. Scary movie two. was just awful. Don't watch it. Scrooge, one of my favorite Christmas movies. Shaun of the Dead, one of my favorite horror comedies. Haven't seen that, haven't seen that. Spaceballs, one of my favorite Mel Brooks movies. I don't know which one's my favorite, to be honest. The South Park movie, one of my favorite musicals and animated movies of all time it's really good really crazy recommend that the songs are great haven't seen team america world police uh, what, I, what else I, what is left that i have seen all right the training places that's pretty good wayne's world love wayne's world one of my favorite comedies the Wedding Singer, that's also pretty good. Zombieland, that's really good. It's one of my favorite zombie movies. I recommend it. And the sequel's coming out, so it's no better time than now. All right, now let's move on to comic book. Well, no, let's do dramas first, because I want to save comic books for later. All right, so The Ocean's Collection. Ocean's Eleven. I li I've seen this. I haven't seen the others. I mean, I've seen that one. That's pretty good. I haven't seen that. I haven't seen that. What have oh, Birdman. Birdman is really good. The whole movie is oddly in one shot. It's kind of... It's really cool. Breakfast Club. One of my favorite high school dramas. I haven't seen that. Creed. A really good com uh, uh, Passing the Torch film. You know, The Departed, Dirty Dancing, Dirty Harry movies. Dirty Harry is one of my favorite cops in a cop movie ever. I probably like the first one best. Or the first two best, anyway. Uh, Footloose. I don't hate it, but I think it's fine. Forrest Gump, one of my favorite dramas ever. I really love Forrest Gump. Tom Hanks is really good in it. Grease, a uh, really good musical. Haven't seen that. One of my favorite Stephen King movies, The Green Mile. One of my favorite prison movies, too. One of my favorite Christmas movies, It's Wonderful Life. Life. Miracle. I thought it was good, but not too good. Mir Moulin Rouge, I thought was fine. And you know, let's just move this out of the way. I haven't seen that one floor of the cuckoo's nest that's pretty good it's kind of sad but it's pretty good i love one floor of the cuckoo's nest uh, pearl harbor is just really awful it's like ben affleck is unlikable and it's not good rocky movies this thing's hang on It's perfect now, because Rocky V doesn't exist. Rocky Valboa, I kind of thought this was better than Creed, but that's just me. I guess because it's more emotional than Creed, we get sort of the in-depth. We get sort of Polly crying, knowing that her sister's, his sister's dead, and, and he didn't appreciate saying anything I thought was okay. The Shawshank Redemption... 
my favorite prison movie and Stephen King movie of all time. I love Shawshank. Sixteen Candles I thought was fine. Stand By Me, another really great Stephen King movie. The kids are good in it. Now, final genre, comic book movies. Now, it's not really a genre, but it is a medium, and I have so many that they deserve their own shelf. So, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. Now, none of the Ninja Turtles are, like, great, but not, not none, of the, none of the Ninja Turtles films are great. But most of them are decent, and that applies with this one. Or the four that are here. I like Ninja Turtles 1 and 2. They're not amazing, but they are pretty good. 3 isn't so good. 4, the, the animated one I have not seen, but it looks pretty good. 4 film Batman collection includes Batman Returns, Batman... For, Batman... Batman, Batman Returns, Batman Forever, and Batman and Robin. I like half of those. Superman, that includes... What do you think, Superman's uh, 1, 2, 3, and 4? I like half of those, as you'd expect. 300, I didn't really enjoy. Hey, the Amazing Spider-Man movies. Amazing Spider-Man 1, it's not the worst movie ever, but it's still not that good. Amazing Spider-Man 2 was god-awful. Gosh, uh... Ant-Man, loved Ant-Man. Ant-Man and the Wasp, that's also really good. Avengers, the Avengers movies. I like Avengers Infinity War the best, but these two, this one's really good. This one's pretty good, but not too good. Animated series, one of my favorite cartoons ever. Batman the Animated Series. Now, this is... Uh, I'm really proud of this one. It includes all the episodes. Batman and Harley Quinn I didn't enjoy. Mask of the Phantasm and Sub-Zero. Mask of the Phantasm is my favorite comic book movie and Batman movie ever. And non-Disney animated movie. Batman Assault on Arkham I thought was pretty good. Batman Begins, really good. Uh, Batman Beyond the Complete Series, great show. Love that show. Uh, yeah, Return of the Joker, really good. Ba Mystery of the Batwoman, not so good. Dark Knight Returns, I loved. Dawn of Justice, not so good. Black Panther, I just thought it was fine. I liked the villain, but... Blade, the Blade movies, now... The first Blade, I like. The second one, I also... The two first two Blade movies are really good. Blade Trinity is just... Not good. Catwoman, I've not seen. I've, I've heard things, though. Cat in America movies. I like... These movies seem to get better and better. Better every time I watch them. And as the series goes on, like... First one I like, second one I really like, and Civil War, I also... Civil War is probably the best out of all the Captain Americas. Daredevil. Full I have not seen, I haven't heard good things. Dark Knight, really good movie. Dark Knight Rises, also really one of the best finales to a trilogy, in my opinion. I, I, I don't really get why everyone got so angry, why some people got so angry about it, but... Their opinion, why not, uh... The Deadpool movies, I like the second one better. Don't judge. Doctor Strange. Fanta the Fantastic Four. The Ghost Rider movies. Uh, the second one's better, but not by too much. The Green Hornet. The Green Lantern. Not... This is not good, the Green Lantern. Guardians of the Galaxy. He, uh... One of my favorite MCU movies. Volume 2 is also pretty good. But, uh... Happiness is a warm blanket. Charlie Brown. Pretty good. Peanuts movie. The Hellboy movies. These are really good. I haven't seen that, but... I like these two. They're really good. And I'm looking forward to the new one with a Stranger Things star, David Harbour. Uh, the Incredible Hulk. I, I think it could have been done better, but... The idea of a Hulk fugitive movie is pretty good, but... 
it, the movie wasn't that interesting. Iron Man and Iron Man. The Iron Man movies, I like the first one a lot. The, the next two are not so good, but they're not, like, awful or anything. Jonah Hex, haven't seen Justice League movie I thought was fine. Okay, I, I had Justice League, the animated series. It's It's up there if you see it, but... Really good show. I've been watching it lately. I just started watching it, actually. Uh, Flashpoint Paradox. Loved, uh... Oh, Justice League Triple Feature. This one is a weird DVD. It includes Under the Red Hood, Gotham Knight, and Batman Year One. Then why is it called Justice League Triple Feature? I have no clue why, but Under the Red Hood is my favorite out of all those. Uh, haven't seen The Extraordinary Gentleman. The Lego Batman movie, I... I didn't like as much as the Lego movie, but I did enjoy it. Lego movie 2 I also really liked. The Lego movie was up there, but that thing is so high. Those ones that I don't have time to talk about it. This one I bought when I was like... 9, I think? I forgot about it. Logan, really satisfying finale to the X-Men movies. Man of Steel... Second worst Superman movie ever. Or, uh... The third worst, actually. Uh, the Mask. Really good movie. The Men in Black movies. I loved the first one. The second one, not so much. I didn't like. Third one I did like, though. Not as much as the first one, but it was pretty good. Pacific Rim. Not much of substance, but it's entertaining. The Peanuts Holiday Collection. They're charming, but they're not, like, classics to me but I do enjoy them the Peanuts movie I really liked Scott Pilgrim vs. the World probably one of my favorite uh, comedies the dramas of all time it's really good it's really creative Sin City and Spawn Spawn is Spider some of my favorite Spideys so my favorite, my, my favorite Spideys right here. Spider-Man Homecoming. It's pretty good. And uh, Sam Raimi movies are also really good. Static Shock. Really good show. Suicide Squad, not so good. Suicide Squad, Hell to Play. Hell to Pay, pretty good. Superman the Animated Series. Probably my favorite depiction of Superman. Even better than Christopher Reeve. Yeah, I said it. Haven't seen Brainiac Attacks or uh, Apocalypse or Doomsday. Have seen Returns. It was Returns. It was okay. The Thor movies. I don't hate these two. I think they're fine. And I don't hate Cat Dennings either. Thor Ragnarok I really loved. loved uh, the Wolverine was okay. Wonder Woman. I thought it was okay. I'm sorry. The X-Men movies. Xana Project. Really good show. That's my favorite one out of all these. It's probably Days of Future Past. But least favorite is Origins of Wolverine. All right, so that's my uh, DVD collection. Uh, I guess I'll see you later when I see Captain Marvel.